Hello everyone, I'm Miko, and I love gaming, and this is Masters of the Universe, He-Man, Defender of Grayskull. Uh, I'm playing this game in celebration of Grayskull Con going on right now in Germany, uh, where my best friend is, so, uh, how you come? <laughs> Hope you're having a good time. Oh, let me fix that, uh... There we go, that's better. Skeletor, come out and show yourself. I sense the planet Eternia is in grave danger. I do not know how. But when isn't it? That's fairly vague. You must find out what is happening before it is too late. You guys should really consider more training. Yep, that's how robots get better at stuff by training. Like, I guess it was Skeletor. And <laughs> they go down. Oh, worthless robots. They told me He-Man was attacking. I said danger. <laughs> <laughs> oh well. A little bit of a deep voice for a sorceress there, but <clears throat> I really like how they actually got the uh, voice actors from the cartoon for this. What happened? All my strength just left me. And in case you don't know, I don't mean the. 80s too, and I mean the uh, early 2000s relaunch. Oh well. Thanks for the heads up. <laughs> it's not like you're in enemy territory fighting right now. I'll be there as soon as I can find a way out of here. Are you kidding me? Did you see how wide apart those bars were? I will send power-ups your way. I guess that is a good excuse for why there are power-ups around. Yes. Saving Grayskull, nothing new. There we go. I have the power! <laughs> Uh, my mom was telling me about how when I was a kid I'd run around in the backyard with a stick going, I have the power! <laughs> and if the implication wasn't clear, yes, I was a fan of the original series back in the day. Uh, in fact, it's pretty much the reason why I speak as fluent English today as I do. Uh, because, you know, when it aired, uh, they weren't yet dubbing kids to, at least not all of them. And some of the ones they dubbed, they did a horrible job on, but I... Uh, on He-Man, they just subtitled it, so... Basically, I was... I think I was like... Three or four when it started airing, and my choices were... Learn to read, or... Learn English. I ended up kind of doing both, but, uh... <laughs> yeah, okay, look at these bars. <laughs> yeah. Like... He-Man he wouldn't have trouble squeezing through those. Look at that. And Adam did, wouldn't have to turn sideways to fit through there. That's kind of ridiculous. Ah, there we go. <laughs> Down with walls. The uh, metal stick. Yeah, thanks for the tutorial. <laughs> oh, that looked good. Just slide around in a circle. <laughs> Out of my way, walls. You're no match for the strength <laughs> might of Castle of Grayskull. And shit. Where's the baddie? Ah, there you are. Hi. <laughs> well, the lock on wasn't perfect, I think, but uh. Okay, I can lock on to stuff. Up, oh, more skulls. Up, oh, hi guys. Never mind me. I'll just slash at your ankles. Ah, there you go. Card room key. Ah, you can't uh, can't swing while you're in the air. That's a little awkward. Uh. Oh, a bit. Down you go. 
Uh, so... What am I doing here? Do I have to interact with something, or...? Hello, panel! Yeah, I will block you! That's a roll, it's a jump, I don't... Hmm. Oh, there it is, okay. Just needed to find another key. Okay, so they can hide those in boxes. Good to know for future reference. Anything else in here? I think so. Up. More generic robot guards. I really don't seem to recall these things from the series, but... Uh, to be fair, it has been like over a decade now since it came out, so... Maybe it's just my bad memory. But not as memorable as the good old floaty droids of the classic series. Yeah, I don't think I need to save. I I'm good. Down you go. Up. Up. Okay, glass shattering. That's probably not a good thing. Up. Dang it. Dodge. The attack controls don't seem quite perfect. Like, no, go into your attack. There we go. The attack combo. Random slowdown. I haven't quite a. Uh, Quite mastered running uh, PlayStation games, apparently. PlayStation 2, correction. Okay, this... Okay, there we go. Oh! Okay, great, I... I see, you're free to Shadow Beast. That's probably bad. Combo! Ah! <laughs> I think he jumped on top of me. Okay, uh, I'm taking a little bit of damage, so I'm gonna... I remember. Yeah, there you go. Heal that. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was gonna be like, oh, I wonder what I can do next. I need to break some boxes, but the key was right there. Thanks for leading me to it, Shadow Beast. Oh, oh you brought a buddy, apparently. Where are you going? Come here so you can die by my sword. Truly, I am the hero, killing dumb beasts. At least the Shadow Beasts had gone on a diet since their uh, classic tune days. They used to look a lot chubbier. But what is that? Uh, what is this? Well, I can't seem to hit it, so. Oh, okay. We're looking at like what's that? Spikes. Yep. Oh. Ah. Into it. Hey, uh, 2000 series He Man logo, which isn't my favorite. Okay, so. Okay, well, uh, thanks for showing me the way, I guess. What was the indirect button again? There we go. Oh, yay! Trap room. My favorite. Uh. City press. Oh, dang it! Ran into it. And how far? Oh no, I'm right here. Okay. Well, that. Well, at least that. No, nope, don't move towards the insta kill thing. For God's sake. <laughs> For Eternia's sake. So slow, slow, fast, 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 and then he goes slow again. Nope, not fast enough. Ouch. Oh god, these... Oh, but I got through anyway. Okay, well, thank you. Uh... Don't... Okay, there we go, I got it through. Alright. Uh, I don't have any, uh, any energy there. Ah, dang it. That's... Okay, that's probably a thing I need to get on. Up, oh, there's another. Huh. And onto the. Yay, there we go. So. Oh. Okay then, fell to my death. Of course. I don't. I. Oh, and I'm behind the. Oh, this is evil. Tex, tex. 
Du, du. No! Oh, come on! Oh, that was BS. What? How did that even kill me? There we go. Okay, let's let's try that again. Okay, so if I stand on it, I slide right off. So maybe I need to jump onto the uh, the walkway up there. I'll try that. It's a bit closer. On here. Up. Oh, oh, hi there. Any more extra lives around? Nope, just the one. Great. So I lost like five lives back there. <laughs> uh, poor rubber dude fell into the <laughs> acid. Yeah, it's acid. Uh, what is that? I don't. Okay, it's some kind of power boost, I guess, which I don't need since I already killed everybody. And that guy fell off too. What next? I can't break those. Okay, I gotta jump onto uh, those things when they come out of there, I guess. And wait for it, and jump onto it. And jump onto it. What is this? I don't know what that did. Um, I guess I can just drop from here. Nothing anywhere to pick up that I can see, so onwards! Yaw. And I took falling damage. <laughs> yes! He-Man takes falling damage from coming down left, what, one story height, give or take. Truly the most powerful man in the universe! And I can't break these boxes for some reason. I'm pretty sure they look exactly like the boxes that I could earlier break, but uh... Okay then. Oh, there's something there. Ah, key! Well, glad I didn't miss that. Throne room key. Just heal up. Ah, another trap room. With fire jets. Okay. That take off huge amounts of damage. Yikes. Okay, uh, that's a little... Okay. I'm seeing a lot of skulls, so that's good. Man, you don't usually say that, do you? <laughs> that's still going? Okay, there we go. Time to kick some ass and juice some bubblegum. And I'm all out of Eternian bubblegum. That was terrible. So I guess you didn't watch my previous, uh... Previous E-Man game video. I could elaborate a little bit on the person I mentioned at the start of this video, uh, known on the internet as Tunyuka, who has been my best friend for what, coming up on a decade and a half in a year or two. Uh, and when we, oh, wow, oh, these guys are still alive. Okay, I'm just walking by right over them. And yeah. Uh, we first met up a few years before we became friends, but uh, the point where our friendship officially began... Escape the Cells of Doom, okay? So I just kind of exited the uh, throne room, I guess. I didn't see any bridge going across there. But yeah, uh, hey, <laughs> rather topical, he managed sword. Uh, he was doodling the, obviously the original because the new tune hadn't come out at the time. Uh, he managed sword into a notebook. And I saw him doing it, and I was like, is, is, this, is that a He-Man store? And that's pretty much how it all started. Like I said, we'd seen each other before, and we were actually uh, taking uh, a couple of the same classes at this... Uh... Thanks for climbing onto that. That really helped, He-Man. Uh, it's like art school, but... But aside from very brief interactions, you know, we didn't really know each other. Uh, we went to the same high school, but we were different. I mean, it's more like junior high, but we we should call it high school. Uh, but we we were in different classes, so we didn't interact that much. But like, for from that moment on, it was go time. We both liked He-Man, and as it turns out, we had a ton of other interests as well. 
common interests. Obviously, <laughs> we had interests, but they were linked. Uh, get it? There we go. And now he's off in Germany as a guest at the convention, so... He's, uh, kept up the he-manning a bit more than me. I'm more focused on other hobbies like, uh, you know, gaming. 